Hey everyone, hope this finds you well. Um, so this is for my website, arielanatole.com, as well as Instagram. Hope all everyone is doing great. Um, as well as my Patreon members. So, um, therapy. As you all know, at the beginning of this week, I was really freaking out about trying to find a therapist because my therapist, congratulations, she's moving on. Um, happy about that, but really sad to see her go. Well, looks like my search is over. I found a therapist. Uh, it's at Metro Wellness. So this is a weird thing. Um, I'm getting my primary care physician uh, there. Um, he, Dr. Leiter, does my like blood pressure and stuff like that. You know, every six months I get a check. Um, I get my psychiatric care there, as everyone already knows, and now my therapy. Uh, to see the rest of this, please click on the link at the bottom of my profile. I would like that. And um, have a very happy we weekend, Instagram. All right, everyone. Ah, really awesome that uh, that I that search is over. Yeah, it. In the middle of the week, I was in pretty much um, pretty bad space. Uh, the problem with mental health access in Tampa is even with the best insurance and I have very good insurance United Healthcare shout out to you um, I there, there just isn't enough people in the field um, and there's not enough respect for mental health so they don't expect people like myself to um, want to get it yeah um, I got sent up to some pretty bad places actually um, and was treated pretty badly by Tampa General. And it really is unfortunate that I have to beg for care, right? It shouldn't be this difficult. Um, especially when we think about what happens when, mental, when people with mental illness don't get the care that they require, right? Um, we are often the shooters. We are often the ones that, that uh, commit suicide so this is like a life-threatening illness and I just wish doctors and nurses and healthcare providers could grasp that this is indeed right <laughs> like mm, I'm fighting for my life here right this is a deadly illness and they don't want to respect that uh, Tampa General says I don't have a real illness I mean they really told me that <laughs> and I'm like um no actually I do and you're insulting me right now <laughs> uh, but I laugh at it and I smile through it and I'll tell you why I am a survivor and I know that depression soon will hit me and it'll be harder for me to smile and it'll be harder for me to laugh. So when I'm in mania, and right now I'm calling this a hypomania because I'm not completely off the rails. So when I'm hypomanic, I embrace it. I smile and greet the sun and like the sweat and, and walk around in almost no clothes because I'm open to what the world has to offer to me, right? And if I only take in positive, then positive starts to feed me and I start to feel better. Not just about myself, but about the world around me. Looking for a therapist, I had to deal with people who give me negative energy, who don't believe my illness is real, who don't have any new appointments and have no desire to have me as a patient. Um, and for a while there, that negative energy was starting to make me feel bad about myself. So maybe just next time, tap a general, when you say you don't have the services, you can be kinder in your words. Just maybe next time, USF, you can respect the fact that I'm a human being and give me the same care that you would give any other fellow human being. I hope this uh, finds you all well. Have a most beautiful Friday and a most beautiful weekend. I, at the end, I want to say thank you for all the donations on my webpage. I sincerely appreciate it. 
Still no patrons yet, but you know what? I'm sure that's gonna happen because it's just a beautiful weekend. Uh, tonight, I've got a grand opening at the Fitzgeralds to see uh, because as you all know, this view will be disappearing come September. Bye.